you can live stream without actually going live. Can I use desktop streaming apps to stream onto Instagram? Look live on Facebook. Is this live? Or did he do a pre-recorded video? And just like that, I'm live on Instagram. But wait, I'm actually right here. One of the benefits of doing that is the fact that your audience may not be available when you are. Maybe your numbers are a little less than what you would want. You can use pre-recorded live streams to reach another audience at a different time without physically having to be there. Back in the day, this used to be a little complicated process, but right now, this is easy. And I'm gonna show you how to do it using a software called Live Pigeon. And if you're interested in this platform, you can get a 14 day free trial using the link in the video description. And if you're an Instagram user, stay to the end of this video because there's a feature that you're really gonna like and it's related to going live. Now you'll see once we're logged in, we have three different platforms that we can connect to. Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. First, we'll start off with YouTube because that's where you're watching me at right now. And then once we've authenticated for YouTube, you'll see that in the upper right-hand corner, it is highlighted and we're ready to go. The next one we'll connect is the Facebook account, which we can do this very same way. But before we move on, I wanna just quickly show you the left side of the panel interface because as you can see, there's a not a lot going on here on this software. And that's what I like about it. It is very easy to use, user-friendly. On the left hand side, underneath our dashboard, we have our incubator section. So any videos that we want to live stream pre-recorded, this is where we're gonna go ahead and upload those videos. If we look at the schedule tab, this is where we're gonna have our scheduled videos. Once we set a date and a time, we'll be able to see that entire schedule of when the videos will be released to those social platforms that we have connected. And any videos that we've completed, we'll see right here. Pretty easy to use, right? So let's jump back up to our dashboard and let's select to schedule a video. With your pre-recorded video, you can actually select the go live now and actually go live at that time. We're actually gonna just schedule a video let's schedule it for Saturday and we'll do 10 and then you notice that on the right hand side you can show your schedule notification by default that is turned on and then you can also use a custom thumbnail as well and I highly encourage you to use custom graphics just because they stand out a little bit more and then we'll schedule our stream now in this next step, this is where we can make sure that we have the right Facebook pages, profiles, and groups that we actually want to live stream this video to. So make sure that you have all of that information placed into your description bar here. And this is where we can upload our file. So if you didn't use the incubator that's included in the software, you can grab your file from a Dropbox or a Google Drive. Now I do have a video, it's one of our latest YouTube videos where we talked about PTZ cameras. So I'm gonna grab that video and then drag and drop it into the software and let it upload. And that's what we're gonna use to schedule and go live. Once a video has been uploaded, we can see that it is ready to go. From this point, you don't have to do anything if you're actually waiting for that designated time and day that you scheduled it earlier. But if you do change your mind and wanted to go live right now, you actually could go live by selecting go live and go live now. You can also look at the posts by going into the view post section and seeing that pre-recorded video is already created a post and ready to go. Automatically, it has gone to my Facebook page and let my audience know that a video is coming at Saturday at 10 a.m. If we jump into the YouTube, same thing here, video scheduled for that specific day and time. And I've already got people reacting to my post, so it's pretty cool to see how quickly people actually see this post and are excited to join in live. And that's the power of pre-recorded live. Now for my Instagram users, you all love to go live. You all love doing reels and all that stuff that goes along with Instagram. Now I'm not a heavy Instagram user, but maybe you guys can change that if you follow me on Instagram. What Live Pigeon allows you to do is take these pre-recorded videos that maybe you've produced and make them go live on the platform without having to use a whole bunch of clunky third-party other software. So if we look back in our platform in the upper left-hand corner, it says connect to Instagram beta. Then we're gonna input our information. Now in the upper right-hand corner, we can see that we're connected to our Instagram account. Let's jump over into the go live now section and because we've already uploaded a video, it's now in our incubator section. So now this video is actually playing 
on my IG account. You saw that there was not a whole bunch of setup to go on. We literally just connected our IG account, uploaded our video, and now our video is playing on IG and I am not there. I'm recording this video for you all showing you how to do it. This is amazing. Keep in mind that any uploaded video that you do want to show on Instagram, you do want to have the aspect ratio as 9 by 16 because in some portions of your video, if it's the complete 16 by 9 wide aspect ratio, you may be cutting yourself out of the video. So make sure you do have videos that are in the 9 by 16 aspect ratio. And if you're doing like a talking head video like myself, just sit right in the middle of the screen. So this has been a tutorial and overview of a pretty cool platform with a unique name called Live Pigeon that I think will really change the game and how people show up on Instagram in addition to going live pre-recorded on Facebook and YouTube. Now, if you wanna see more videos just like this one, make sure you hit the thumbs up button and make sure you're subscribed to the channel if you haven't already. We have a lot more videos coming out around the world of live streaming and I'm excited to share those with you. In the meantime, watch one of the videos right here on the screen and I'll see you in the next one.